I just don't get how these people can get high every night and feel like it's okay. Oh, I know. It's like clearly you're trying to run away from your problems. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry, but if you're sticking a cat's ass in your face, you obviously aren't happy with your marriage. <laughs> yes, I think a lot of these druggies do what they do because they're in unhappy relationships. <laughs> they probably get high because they feel trapped somehow with their spouse. That must feel horrible. <laughs> Ooh. <sighs> Would anyone like me to go over today's special? There they are. Where's the girl? He was just here. You didn't see her come in? Uh, no, we were busy sinking our watches. No, we were looking at menus because Cartman made us order food. Fighting crime on an empty stomach is very dangerous, human cat. It's for your own good. Whatever. She couldn't have left. We would have seen her go out the front door. Well, then maybe she's in the back. Okay, you guys check it out. Call us if you need help. We'll be waiting for you with our breadsticks. <laughs> We need to get all this fast in the meatballs. That's it to the customers. Huh, what's huh, that? Huh. Keep those at the pasta to cover with the raw tomatoes and the bacon. Uh. you home to mama in the doggy bag. Uh, you got screwed. The coon will bring you dastardly chefs to justice. Well, we're just making the pasta and the scallopini. Get <laughs> Pretty sure I can fit your whole body in a stock pot, little shit. Got a beating on deck. Ah! Tell me when you've had enough! We got this guy! I'm gonna grill you under a brick. Hold still! That ought to break down your collagens. Okay, let's see what you got, new kid. Need so many pots and pans for that. I guess we can store your corpses in the walk-in for a good six weeks. Hey. Uh, I'm gonna debone you, kid. This kitchen is about to heat up. take abuse from the head chef in this kitchen. You're about to become just another stain on my apron. Bottoms up. <sighs> I'm gonna dip my balls in your sauce. No, no, not, not the massage. This might sting. If they touch me again, I'm making you all bus boys. I'm gonna violate your health code. That makes no sense! Yeah. That's tenderizing. I'm counting on you, partner! Ha! This guy 
Eggs are no match for us. Ow. You want a cream fresh bukake with that? Whoa! Sorry to break up the pizza party. <laughs> Pretend that really hurt. My friends are watching. Prepare for a vicious squinting. Your thumb marks me, human height. Well, it's kind of hard to miss when you aim just by looking. Well, now that you put it that way, how could you ever miss? Watch this, new kid. I'm gonna do something fucking sweet. Yeah. Oh yeah, this one bleeds real nice. Show them what you're made of, butthole. Feed you corn and hop. Harvest your. Oh my god, the butt lord bucked you. Oh wow, you see what I just did, guys? Yes, Captain, we saw it. I forecast gentle breezes with a high chance of lasers and burning. the Alfred to your Batman? I'm a gonna turn you into a Brachiola that make it the mouth water. <sighs> oh, me oh mama, I'm like a lamb to the slaughters. <laughs> ah! Do that again and I flatten you like a, like a dip de de piadina. That's a left-handed spatula. On deck. The rest of you try not to die. Now go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. You've got this, butthole. Okay, see you guys later. We're gonna go do some real superhero shit. Somehow. Of course, with my super strength, I can knock it over. Huh? But I can't use apple juice without my insulin. <laughs> Wait, that's it? Your fart psychic? Your terrible farts that throw me into fits of rage? Of course. The coon wasn't trying to make me feel insecure when he told me that my mom's farts gave me diabetes. He was trying to help me unlock my true powers. We've got to get through there and get the classy sidekick for the good of South Park. For Coon and friends, I need you to fart on my face. <laughs> I am not amused. Don't be shy. Alright, ready when you are. One diabetes rage coming up. We did it. The path is clear. It's hard for me to lose control of myself. 
But if we're ever in a dire situation like that again, Psychic, know that you can fart in my face. Hold on, Psychic. Sounds like there could be trouble behind that door. There's someone in there. Get ready. One, two, Diabetes! <laughs> See, I told you the cops were chasing me. And you led them here, you stupid bitch? Uh-uh. Who are you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like your mama? These kids are cops? That ain't no cop. That's Captain Diabetes. When he was born, his mom farted during labor, and it gave him diabetes that he uses to fight crime. And that is not how people get diabetes. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot them, along with this bitch, too. Oh, shit. Y'all turning on me? I knew I shouldn't have went into business with y'all Tony Soprano-looking motherfuckers. So long, Captain Diabetes. Let's see your diabetes savior now. Uh-oh. Ah! What the? I want my keys! I don't have your keys, man. Ah! He's wasted on red wine. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. Ah! Ah! Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, Captain Diabetes. This is it. Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die. Mr. Mark, let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this, you little prick. My kid. Uh-uh, that's not fair. Y'all can't be using your ass to speed up time and skip people's turns and shit. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. Sharon's texting me. I can't type. Why the fuck can't I type? Why are my thumbs so big? Hey Siri, fucking take a note, tell my wife. Fuck off. Fighting. Poop emoji. Ah! 
like a fucking jungle cat. Yeah, Ooh. he's totally out of his mind. Yeah. Yeah. I think we underestimated the power of red wine. This is for scrambles, you bastards. I can feel pain again. I will save you from yourself. What's in the coon saves the day? All right, I'm gonna take a cab. There, nobody drinks and drives on Captain Diabetes' watch. Where is Scrambles? Scrambles? We need this reward money for our superhero franchise. Oh, shit. Y'all just want a cat. So then there's Cisco. He just some low-class asshole started working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hookers and shit, right? Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't putting no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, I'm sorry, but what what about the cats? Oh, that cats? Okay, that's this little Asian freak named Yakibaba or some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that pussy and, like, taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe, you understand? These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Cartman, do you have any idea what time it is? This is a school night. Mom, not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Sorry, Mrs. Cartman. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? These cone friends offer me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine, fast pass, take her to your house. Okay. And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Buca de Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick? There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now, who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. 
This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet or people are gonna learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. Oh, man, what a great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. How'd you do that? That was dumb. <laughs> My parents were out partying until 3 a.m. last night. WTF? You screwing around too much? Bet you are. My lord, it's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen, act. Wait. Sure, let's take a picture. And now you're taking a selfie with the DJ at the strip club.
Here, kitty, kitty. Come on, kitty. A little fourthy of what? spreading some good chaos. Here, pussy pussy. See you later, Forthy. I'll be waiting for you. Jimmy from my Peter, Billy. Can you get me a condom? No way, Kurt. Your follower count is way too low. I... Don't know what you did, but whoever was king my car finally quit, so sure, I'll do a selfie with you. Great.
Come out, come out, wherever you are, kitties. That's what I thought. That's a good fourthy. Come a little closer. Come here, fourthy. I'll show you how to pop wheelies. What's wrong, fourthy? Chicken? <laughs> Look at you with all that storage on your device. little cuckoo kid. Oh, it's you again. Sup, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, Fast Pass, one of your super homies is here. Oh, hey, new kid. The coon told me he wants you to question the witness, so go ahead. Have at it. Go ahead, new kid. Ask her anything you want. Oh, that's smart. Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a antsy. I right, look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you. Go get my medication. Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Well, all right, fine. Looks like you got more work to do, new kid. But before you go back out in the world, I want to show you something that might help your crime fighting. Let's get up to my room, the bed. All right, new kid. It's time to take your superpowers to the next level. Go ahead and stand in the DNA fibrillator. All right, new kid, just stand still, and I'll talk you through this. Check out the new hero DNA slot I opened up for you. Stuff you insert here will make a big impact on your combat path, path, your combat path effectiveness. Pick the one that best suits your power loadout. Just keep in mind that a big damage boost may mean less health, or vice versa. Kind of like how steroids shrink your buffs, or so I've read. Alright, now you know what real power feels like. Pretty dang good. That should do it, new kid. Hope you have a grasp of it. Now get out there and kick some booty.
Okay, this is the human kite. You know that little problem you helped me take care of? Well, it's back. Can you come to my house ASAP, please? Hey, let's pencil in some time tomorrow when you can pester me. It'll be great. Oh, hey there, little buddy. Your dad's moving kind of slow today. Here, pussy pussy.
go, kitties. I got porn to watch. Thanks for coming. It's over here. In the backyard. I'm big! Will you deal with him, please? Look, Cousin Kyle, it's that mean kid who beat me up before. Yeah, oh no, somebody stop him. Don't worry, Cousin Kyle, I have developed these super sensors which will make it almost impossible for him to beat us up this time. I have to stay out of this. Just please, please make him go away. Prepare to meet your doom, evil bully kid. represents the Red Sea, which you will be unable to part without Moses on your side. Okay, I'm gonna try something a little crazy. Everyone brace yourselves. <laughs> that wasn't too hard, right? I don't want to cause any permanent damage. Don't mess this up, dickbag. Captain Guy B, prepare to strike. Hey, Nick! Maybe we can be pals after you check out of the ER. Not your laptop! Lights, teeth, whatever. I have had it with this shit. You're not gonna know what hit you, but it was definitely the team. Supposed to attack now, right? Oh goodness. Your turn is now property of Coon and friends. <laughs> oh jeez, did you have to hit so hard? Here we go. Oh, I just know I'm gonna mess this up, and here we go. Yeah. Oh, jeez, I didn't think I'd actually hit you. It's go time, butt lord. shall use his Hebrew faith to call upon the power of the wind. Hikmeo Shigina. Let the strength of the wind make my kite fly and... Oh, Jesus, it came off. Oh, Jesus, my kite just blew up into the tree, Cousin Kyle. Then give up. Don't worry, Super Buddy Cousin. Perhaps I no longer have my kite, but I still have my super weapon. <gasps> And Sheila! These kids are picking on me! What but what? Who's picking on you? Who are you kids? I'll call your mothers right now! Yeah, get him, Aunt Sheila! Oh, I'm up now? Do you want me to go again? I can, I can wait? No? Ah. Fucking destroy you! Ma, 
I do. The human kite is about saving people, not about Judaism. And now look at all the damage you've caused. I should press charges against your friends. And lug my kite up in a tree. I'm sorry. Please, I'll do anything. You are going to let your cousin play with you from now on. Is that clear? Oh boy, Kyle and Sheila says I get to play with you. Yes, sometimes you can play with us. Yippee! Now get your cousin's kite out of that tree. You're not playing anymore until you do. Come on, Shugana. Let's get you some Bactine. Oh, I hate Bactine because it gets on my fingers and I get eczema from the lidocaine. Well, crap. How are we going to get that kite down? So what the hell do we do now? though. Kind of embarrassing. Now 
Now this may sting a little, Bubby. Oh, is it supposed to burn, Aunt Sheila? Because it's stinging and it's burning. That's how you know it's working. Oh, ow, ouch. Look, Bubby, they got your kite out of the tree. Yay, I can fly again. Time to be the biggest superhero, Cousin Kyle, and forgive our new neighbor. Why don't you two take a nice photograph together? someone to kill you. Both of them are equally both of them are equal equally chance to I can't say it's right. Both of them have equal chance both of them have equal chances of happening. I'll be changing later. <laughs> <laughs> 